Without wasting any time, guys, take a look at this channel. It started on October 6th and has already gained over 40,000 subscribers with a simple niche. The videos focus on famous characters, showcasing what they looked like when they were young versus how they look now. For example, check out this popular video. It has surpassed 4 million views, which is an incredible achievement for a new channel. In this video, I'll explain how you can create similar videos, step by step. I'll also show you how to use templates to make more videos like this without starting everything from scratch. Let's dive in. But before we dive in, let's check out one of these videos. I've chosen this one. As you can see, this video doesn't have any voiceover. We'll do even better by adding one to make our content stand out. Also, don't forget to join our free Telegram community. It's a great place where we help and support each other. Drop a simple comment to encourage us to keep exploring this niche together. Let's make it happen. So first, you'll start by choosing the idea for your video. For example, you could create a video about the evolution of 80s and 90s actresses, what they looked like then versus now. Or you could make a video about the top famous actors of the 1980s, then and now. If you like, you can use these two ideas or simply ask ChatGPT to generate more ideas in a similar style. Once you've chosen your idea, the next step is to ask ChatGPT for help with the details. For example, you can use a prompt like this. Generate a table with the name of the actor, their age in 1980, and their age in 2025. This will give you a ready-to-use list of data for your video, simple and efficient. Once ChatGPT generates the information, the next step is to head over to Google and search for images of the actors from the 1980s and their recent photos. Download two images for each actor, one from the past and one from the present. Make sure to check the copyright usage rights for all images before using them. Next, go to 11 Labs and select the voice you want to use for your voiceover. Personally, I like using Adam's voice. Then, return to ChatGPT and copy each actor's name along with the details you generated earlier to create a voiceover script. Use 11 Labs to generate and download the voiceovers for all your text. After that, visit Pixabay to find a cool background music track that fits this niche. Once you choose one, download it. But again, don't forget to carefully read the copyright usage terms to ensure compliance. Now you're ready to bring everything together for your video. Now let's open CapCut and start assembling everything you've downloaded. Images, audio, and music. First, we add the actor's 80s image to the timeline. Adjust the image duration to 3 seconds. Then, add the recent image of the same actor and set its duration to 3 seconds as well. Repeat this process for all the actors, making sure each image is 3 seconds long. Next, adjust the aspect ratio to 9 to 16 for the best presentation and zoom in on each image to fill the screen properly, like you see in the example. Now, let's add some effects. For every image, apply the vignette effect and adjust the opacity to 50% to give a smooth, professional look. For the older images, we'll add a noise effect, but reduce its opacity slightly to maintain that nostalgic vibe. Now your video is looking great with a clean, professional presentation. Now, it's time to add the text information about the actors. For the first actor, 
Copy the name from ChatGPT and add it to the video as text. Then, change the text style and color to match your preferred aesthetic. Adjust the position of the text and make sure the name stays on screen for about two seconds. Next, repeat the process for the actor's age and photo year. For the old images, you'll set the year to 1990 as an example. Adjust the placement, font, style, and color of the text for each of these details. After that, select all the text layers and add a simple in animation to make them appear smoothly, followed by a fade-out animation for when the text disappears. Now, to save time, copy the text elements and paste them at the beginning of the second image. All you need to do is modify the text for the next actor, and you've quickly added the same effect for each. Continue this process for all the images. After adding the effects, we'll move to the transitions. Between the two images of the same actor, then and now, use the then and now transition. For transitions between different actors, use the mixed transition to make the video flow seamlessly and keep the viewer engaged. Once all the images are on the timeline, it's time to add the voiceover. Go to each first image and add the corresponding voiceover, the actor's name, making sure it syncs with the images. Once the text is in place, add your background music to the timeline. Don't forget to reduce the volume of the music slightly so it doesn't overpower the voiceover. And that's how you create your first video. If you have long form videos and want to extract viral shorts from them using AI, I've got a magic solution for you. That's why you should try Nexus Clips. This tool is a favorite among creators of long form videos and live streams. Thanks to this platform, you can easily create multiple short videos from a single long form video. For example, let me show you how it works. I have a long video here that I want to turn into short clips. First, click on this option and select your video. The tool uses AI to suggest moments, providing a simple rating for each one. As you can see, this moment in the video has an 85 rating. You can either choose the suggested moments or create your own clip by clicking the Create Clip button on the right. Before you start, make sure to connect your YouTube or Twitch account. Once that's set up, Select the part of the video you want, then click Edit Clip. Wait a few seconds, and boom. Now you can customize how your video looks. For example, I'll add my AI avatar at the top and place the screen at the bottom. You can also add stickers, hooks, and subtitles with various templates. After finalizing your edits, download the video by clicking the Share button. This tool works for any niche, so give it a try. Nexus Clip link in the description.